All right, I'm going to work on the upper part of this uh, warrior's le left side uh, of his chest. I've mounted the camera on my uh, little turntable here, and it's probably going to be knocking tools off my sculpting stand. <laughs> I'm trying to give you the best possible views of what I'm working on. All right, time to get busy. Time to play with some clay. Now you might hear a grinding noise. And that's because the camera is locked in on my turntable here. And uh, so it may make noise. Gotta be real careful. I don't want to make them too muscular. Now so his back is going to be covered by a, a wing. I just don't know how I'm going to have the wings yet. And so I'm going to be uh, exploring that idea. I'm going to, what I'm going to do is m make two or three mock-up wings and then just see what uh, looks best. But uh, right now I have no clue how this piece is going to turn out. I got it in my mind. But as far as how it's going to turn out, I don't know. I'm just taking it one little bit at a time and hoping I don't screw it up. By the way, I know I've mistakenly called this super clay super sculpty but it's not it's it's uh monster clay and uh i don't uh want to confuse you but i i get for some reason i got monster super sculpty in my brain and i've never used super sculpty i've always used monster clay Well, I'm glad I made these tools out of uh, latex. They're much better than your finger. <laughs> For getting into areas. I'm kind of liking working with this uh, monster clay. It's uh, not as hard to work with. I mean, it is in some respects harder than uh, plastiline clay because it doesn't stick quite as easily. But... Uh, you can do things that I can't, with this clay, that I can't do with plastiline clay, which is uh, putting a thin layer of this clay over 
the muscles and uh, that I made and uh, being able to have something that will hold up once it cools off it gets uh, hard enough it holds its uh, shape really well I guess at some point I'm going to have to decide what kind of uh, hairstyle I'm going to be putting on this guy Yeah, I find myself using these metal tools a lot more with this monster clay than I did with the plastiline.
I'm going to be ordering some more of this stuff. I'm kind of liking it. You don't have to worry about making a sudden movement and changing a whole face. Just trying out different hairstyle here. I'm experimenting, don't get excited yet. I'm kind of liking the way this turned out, and we'll have to wait and see how I feel tomorrow. If I still feel the same way tomorrow that I feel right now. I like the way the hair has turned out on this. Uh, I'm going to have to fill in little areas back here but in there, but I'll do that tomorrow when the clay is a little stiffer. And I'll see how I feel about this tomorrow. Right now, I kind of like it. And uh, we'll see how I feel tomorrow. All right. Good night, everybody. Have a great night, and I'll see you next time. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to my channel. It really would help me. Also, check out the link below this video. It will take you to a review of my nine instructional videos that could be very helpful to you if you're thinking of sculpting. Good night, everybody.